What is up, guys? Welcome back to Leslie Jones Tarot. This reading here is for my Cancer Zodiac sign. We're going to tap into the energy, what, what's coming for you in the month of May. Just see what's happening, what energy is surrounding you. Just a general reading. Clarify the energy of Cancer for the month of May 2021, please. What's going on with Cancer? Crown Chakra coming out. Clarify the energy of Cancer for the month of May. Okay, let me get the card. And the trust card, okay. So listening to your crown chakra, meta, uh, manifesting something here. We do have dreams coming true at the bottom of the deck. Let's pull a soul's journey card here. What message do you have for Cancer for the month of May 2021? Message for Cancer. Two of them. We have adversity. I accept the challenges are the best way to learn. And acceptance, I am learning to accept the things that I cannot change. Again, your crown chakra is here and the trust card. So the crown chakra is all about uh, manifesting in the spirit realm, bringing it down to the physical realm. And the trust card is taking a leap of faith here. Okay, and adversity, I accept the challenges are the best way to learn. So you understand that there's situations that come up and that need to happen and you learn from them. And acceptance, I am learning to accept the things that I cannot change. You understand that there's going to be roadblocks, and it is what it is. That's okay, but you're a lear you're learning and accepting that that's okay, and I can learn from that, you know? So let's see here. Let's pull out the Gilded Royale deck. All right, let's see. Clarify the energy of Cancer, please. Clarify Crown Chakra for May 2021. Thank you. Clarify crown chakra. Okay, so you understand that there are difficulties that you have to go through in order to get to this nine of pentacles energy, which is the single success, right? Being independent and being successful here. So you understand that with the five of uh, swords. I'm sorry, if I said wands, I apologize. Five of swords. The five of swords represents, you know, having to fight your way through difficulties and move forward here. Two of uh, swords on the bottom of the deck still make energy. So you know that there were difficulties and there were situations you had to go through. But you have to trust the process here because it is going to get you to the other side, which is that success and that abundance that you're um, searching for here. Clarify adversity and acceptance here. Clarify adversity and acceptance, please, for cancer. Two of cups in reverse. Clarify adversity and acceptance for cancer, please. And the seven of cups in reverse. So, yeah, some things didn't work out. Relationships didn't work out. Opportunities that you wanted didn't come through. Opportunities that you thought you had weren't weren't available. Okay, and that's okay. You realize that not everything is going to go in your favor. And not everything's going to work out the way that you expect it here, right? Sometimes things just don't happen. And sometimes things just don't show up for you. And that's okay. You're realizing it. You're accepting it. And you're moving on, right? The sun card. You're finding happiness, though, regardless. At the end of the day, you're finding a way to be happy here. Okay? So, let's see. What's going on as far as love for Cancer? What's going on as far as love for May 2021? For Cancer, what's going on as far as love? So, we have the Temperance, the Six of Cups, and the Wheel of Fortune. Yeah. Being patient. You know, finding peace with thyself. Being in tune with yourself here. The Temperance is all about patience and waiting and allowing the divine to take care of it. Allowing for divine timing to happen here. We do have the Six of Cups, which is the um, childlike energy, nostalgic type of energy. So you could be reminiscing on um, when you were a child or the happiness that you once had as a child. But this could also represent someone coming from the past here. Okay, from childhood. Someone you grew up with. Someone that you created memories with here uh, in the month of May. And then we have the Wheel of Fortune, which tells me that things are turning in your favor here, okay? Things are going to start happening for you in the month of May. That, um, again, the person coming in from the past could be coming in to offer you love and offer an opportunity here for you. But just be open-minded to each opportunity that's available for you in the month of May. And think positive, okay? Because, again, the wheel is turning in your favor. All right, so let's see. Uh... What other messages do we need to pull here? All right. Any message for love for the month of May? Any message you would like to give Cancer for the month of May? Any other love message for Cancer for the month of May? 
All right, so we have this card here and it says secret admirer. So someone has deeper feelings for you than they are letting on. Again, this person, Six of Cups energy. They could be watching you and seeing uh, what you're about and how you're being peaceful and graceful here with moving forward and accepting things as they are. And so this person is looking at you and admiring you and realizing how beautiful and how much you have to offer. So they, they're definitely coming in towards you here. All right, so let's pull the romance cards. Clarify for the energy of cancer for the month of May 2021. What's happening in the month of May as far as love relationships? Love and relationships for cancer in the month of May 2021. Thank you. So children, your love life is being affected by children. Okay, so you could have kids and that could be one reason why you're not really focused on love. Okay, clarify the energy. And we have forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. Okay, so again, you could be dealing with situations from the past, okay, due to childhood. Um... But we do have children. So for some of you, you definitely have kids, okay? Or you may be meeting someone with children and you may not be interested in that person with kids. But then we also have forgiving and learning. And so I feel like, again, you've, you're you going through a transition here. You're learning, you're growing, you're forgiving, and you're moving forward here, all right? And of course, why not? Let's end you off with a Whisper of the Ocean card deck or card here clear by the energy for cancer what message do you have for cancer we have number 30 surrounded by prosperity your attention is being drawn to the infinite nature of reality that which ex exists outside the known is beyond measure okay so again creating what you want in the crown chakra manifesting it spiritually and bringing it down to the physical realm so if it's money you're definitely about to get money if it's love you know the um the the divine is saying this is perfect timing for you. Anything is possible. You know, whatever you want to create, you can definitely create here. Okay, just uh, dream it, think it, and make it happen. And then let's end you off with your divine door, Cancer. Clarify the energy. What message do you have for Cancer? What door would you like to end Cancer off with? So we have this door here and it says deeper you are not finished you are not yet done dig deeper and deeper the best is to come hold on hold on so yes again you're realizing that challenges they do happen situations they do happen speed bumps they do happen but it's not about giving up it's about continuing to manifest think dream and believe and you can create what you, whatever you want so in the month of may you definitely have many opportunities to come for you so this is your reading, Cancer. I hope this gives you some clarity and some insight. Guys, I appreciate you so much for watching, and we'll catch you in the next video. Bye, guys.